hi there once again welcome to agile tech i'm delighted to have you back on my channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how you can easily track negative and positive numbers in excel so it's just a simple strategy a simple logic statement we're going to use to do that let's say for instance i go ahead and then i enter a number 90 you can see it's giving me a positive a positive as a result if i should go up if i should so you can see it's giving me positive if i should go ahead and then enter minus six you can see i'm getting what negative so you can easily use this simple strategy i'm going to teach you to actually detect numbers that are negative and then positive and you can use that to track maybe account balance that you have in your excel files once the account is negative you assume that the person is not having a uh, money in account and then you can use go ahead and then use this strategy to do so many amazing stuff so let's jump right into action and then learn how to do this but before that remember to subscribe hit the like button and share this video with friends and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so let's jump right into action so i'm going to clear all this and let's go see how and let's see how this formula is going to work how we equal to it's going to use if statement you can say if so we're going to use the quantity column to determine whether the number the quantity is negative or positive so you're going to say if so that's the quantity column so this is going to be f2 we select this and say f2 if this is less than zero so if it's less than zero we're going to say it's what a negative value so we'll put that into bracket and see what negative okay just close it in quotes and break comma and then the next condition is going to be if that's going to be the same column again f2 but this time around if it's greater than zero then it's going to be what positive figure okay so we're going to say for positive so this is just a straightforward and it's very, very simple and anyone at all can do it you can leave a comment at the comment section if you have any suggestion or you have any video you want me to create i just i will just reply and then i will create that video for you so you just have to close this bracket the number of times you open it so i open two brackets i'll just close it that number of times and then i'll go ahead and what hit enter so you can see automatically minus 45 is a negative value so you can say the same word negative if i drag this down a bit if i drag this down and then you can see the next number is a positive number so you can use this ahead you can just drag this across to the rest and then it will select the negative figures from it and then we'll see the positive as well if i go ahead and i add a new number let's say 90 you can see it's going to be positive i should go ahead and enter minus 80 is going to be negative so this is a simple strategy just look at the formula again just a simple formula so once the value is less than zero that is going to be negative and then if it's greater than zero then what is a positive number so this is a simple strategy to teach you how to easily track negative values from maybe you have some figures in excel you want to select people who score negative and then you want to select them out of the positive you can use this to track that thank you so much for visiting my channel and thank you for watching this tutorial like come your way again stay tuned and stay alert share this video with a friend and don't leave here without subscribing because i have amazing content coming your way right here on this channel bye bye